Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you have enjoyed my previous video which I reviewed my LV Palm Springs backpack in the mini size. Right, today I'm going to talk about my work bag. Um, I was looking for a new designer work bag last year and um, I decided to get go into the Louis Vuitton boutique and have a look. So first thing first, th the requirement of the bag that I had in mind was that first it has to have a top handle, it has to have a shoulder stripe and it should not be too big. Um, it should be of like a medium size so that I could put in all my work stuff but yet it doesn't look too bulky so um, when I saw when when I saw this bag it was not in my radar because I did not look at the Louis Vuitton website at that point of time so I, I didn't know of this bag so I, I actually went in in the mind of buying another bag but then I saw this bag and I think that this is a better suit for me. Right, so here you go. The bag comes in a big uh, box which my lovely SA gave me. And then of course there's a it comes with in a dust bag as well. Okay, so let me put this aside. So the bag I'm going to show you guys is the LV Phoenix in the PM size monogram print. Right, um, I've been using this bag non-stop for the past one year. Um, I really liked it. Um, I think this is a good investment bag and it's a good bag for work so it's available in the monogram print as well as the epi leather i'm not too sure whether is this still available in the boutique i tried to look in the u.s website but i couldn't find this bag um, anymore so i'm not too sure whether is it still available Okay, so um, it comes in two sizes, the PM size, which is the one that I've got, and the other one is the MM size. I'll link down the sizes below for both, both of the bag. Okay, so a little bit of the, um, uh, a little bit about the dimension of the bag. The length is fourteen point six inches. The height is. 9.4 inches okay, and the width is 5.5 inches okay so uh, it comes with a shoulder strap two toron handle okay. right okay um okay it comes um i if i'm not mistaken Okay, the the color of the handles and the edges comes in black, red, or the normal, the usual leather from LV. Okay. So moving on, it closes through a magnetic. Um, it's a magnetic closure. Okay, so how you open the bag is that you just pull this bag. And then when I close it, you just snap it closed. So which I find it very convenient. And initially I was kind of worried that the magnetic stripe will wear off, like it will not become it will not be as pop as a tight as it would be. But then again I think it's still fine. Okay. So let me show you the interior of the bag. Okay, it comes in a uh, interior zip pocket. Okay, and two smartphone pocket. Okay. I will also show what 
can be fit, what can fit into the bag as well. For the price of the bag, um, this is my receipt. Okay. So I bought this bag uh, last year in the LV Boutique in Singapore. Okay, let me have a look. Okay, so... Um, Okay, I've paid um, $2,670 for this bag which I do think that is quite a reasonable price okay, So let me show you what I could fit into my bag uh, This is what I usually carry uh, for work okay. Alright, this is my foldable umbrella okay I have a recycle bag okay S some some paper stuff okay uh, this is my small pouch which I put my uh, lip palm and some lady stuff okay this is also a pouch for my lady stuff it's my um, earphone okay my long LV wallet if I'm not wrong this should be the Emily wallet okay um, some a tissue pouch okay more tissue pouch so in the zip pocket okay I have a, a, a pen uh, a lipstick um, palette a lip serum palette from Suwasu uh, which I intend to give to my friend and my LV small pouch I think this is called the eclair I'm not too sure how do I pronounce it so inside I'll keep um, my train card and um, other knickknacks and cons okay so um, some likes and dislikes of this bag Okay, lights. This is a good mid size. It contains all my work essential. Okay, it's a nice shape, and the back is pretty hardy. Um, I I basically do not baby it. I place it on the floor. I I chuck it on the sofa. Okay, and um, you can look at. The base of the bag is pretty new. Well, I forgot to mention it's in uh, gold hardware as well. So it comes with four feet. Okay. Okay. Right. Now, um, the only thing, the only thing that I do not like about this bag is the shoulder strap. Um, the shoulder strap, as you can see, is pretty thin. So my stuff are pretty, my work stuff is pretty heavy. So I find that whenever I carry this bag, it cuts into my shoulder and it's quite painful. So what I did was that I don't actually use this uh, shoulder strap. I bought another strap to replace the shoulder strap. Okay, let me show you so um, I use this thicker shoulder strap which I bought from a online seller okay. well although this is silver hardware and my bag is gold hardware but I I did not 
I did not originally buy this right for this bag. I bought it for my uh, other bags, which I will tell you more. So this is intended for another bag, but I decided to still use this for the LV bag. So this is so much better. As you can see, this is a thicker stripe as compared to the LV one. So when I use this, uh, I find it very comfortable and it sits well on my shoulder. Okay, so um, as another minus um, point of this bag is because of the, the closure, the magnetic, magnetic closure so, and the shape of the bag, so um, there is some, some, some marks over here which I think it, it cannot be helped. Okay, uh, I think this is the normal wear and tear. This is pretty common. Right, so I hope I have covered um, the bag, the bag essentials of this bag. And please leave me a comment if you need to ask me anything about this bag. So I guess that's all for this video. And I'll see you soon for another bag review. Bye!